Hello and welcome back to Vambrace. We're heading out again. I, I think we should just go in the other way this time. And uh, also we have the option to head back into town. So maybe that's gonna be something we're gonna do after one, I don't know, tough mission. But I didn't see that option last time. So I'll just check this place out. Jeez, apparently we don't know how it's called. There's a shortcut to it, if you want to I'll do that. But I suppose taking the wrong load, wrong uh, longer road, can be very profitable. Do I want to put Lyric further than Luther? Maybe so. Free damage. Yeah, I'm gonna need some awareness. I'm not sure if, like, maybe Looter being in the front is gonna help somewhat, but I don't really wanna put him. Wait. It doesn't matter, right? It doesn't matter. The first two slots are completely identical. Right? I think they are. So. Yes, so he can lead the party from the front and every ability in the game either targets the first two uh, yeah, first two or all well it's not really differentiated but you can only target the first one as long as we don't put him in the back it's the same thing Oh crap, already fighting with some guys? No! Well, the question is like, do enemies have a preference for the first slot instead of the second one? Mad survivor, so they all start with crazy damage. Necroslave. Well, he's coming now. Next one is the Mad Survivor, which we can blow up. So with this one, we actually prevent his damage. Actually, can we prevent his damage some other way? No. We need to use the special ability to do that. No Mad Survivor. Then we can use a shout on everybody. If we wanna... ...control their damage. Okay. Obviously. Oh no! Oh, he's using special ability, I suppose. But maybe he dealt less damage anyway. This is a really good kill. Very good special ability, I like it. Uh, if we can take out this guy, that would be really good. Actually, it can be done because of the boost. But we don't even have to use the special ability now. Well, we don't really have a choice here. I'm not sure about this guard thing. We can wait to act later. In guard? Do I want to do it now? Maybe I'm gonna do it right at some time, but it actually doesn't matter if we don't do anything. I just wanna kill this fool. This was a pretty well done. I like it. We did use uh, special powers. I'll just take it off. Alright, dwarf, you go first. Uh, we don't really... Yeah. Our highest status too, when it comes to getting stuff, which is not great, but we're not gonna get a lot of stuff. Okay, that was a fight. I can avoid it and just go up top, but I'm not sure how I want to do that. Let's go this way. Oh, 
Playoff trap. Avoided! Wow, we avoided 8 damage. And possibly some other effect. So... Oh, we can rest. If we want to. Do we want to? Not sure I want to. Let's try it. Obviously, Bora Kang is the one who uh, is really good at this. Maybe we can get some boost for, for everybody. Well, the Geist Remater goes up. Uh, this game doesn't really tell you what, what the things do, so I guess we're gonna try it out. Let's entertain the comrades, and apparently... And maybe this is gonna act in rest as well. Despite the dire situation, your party enjoys some time of meritment. Gain vigor equal to the Overwatch. Plus uh, 5 terror. Okay. That's interesting. I can't use that. Seems like that's not the end of it. I can try to Wait talk there. to people. A spook once tried to pull a fast one on me. Then, uh, put the uh, blunderbuss there with left. Okay, I'm really butchering this. Uh, whatever was left of that. What, what was left of his head. And, uh, he gave me a discount. Uh, sure. Oh, is that the... And, Gerard? The great merchant really be trusted? Oh, she's so... She's so sweet. What's this? Uh, yes, I will sleep. What is this? What did we get out of it? Gain health equal to overwatch. Plus 5 terror. Wow, that's pretty handy. What about the last one? Oh, that's that was the last one. So we have the ability to give the party health equal to Overwatch, give the party vigor equal to Overwatch, one spare campfire, and uh, that's it. We can't use it anymore. We can break camp. And we can't use that. And we, we technically can talk to people, but it really doesn't serve too much of a purpose. Still, this kind of makes it clear that having a party member that has high overwatch is pretty useful. Very useful. Look at that. Four. If he, if he didn't have Bora Kang, then we would have to use with uh, twos here. So, just her presence, and also keep in mind, this is not just, uh, this this gonna actually fill it up, so I'm not exactly sure how the game works exactly at this point, but if we just keep finding campfires, then she just keeps uh, giving more and more, so it's not exactly like, you know, you have two more health and two more vigor, it's not exactly that, but you can just, like, keep filling it up. It just really adds up. Okay. Question is how many rooms we need to explore, because apparently you need to explore at least five. I recall something like that was said. Oh. I got the enemy in my sights. Uh oh. It, they really showed up. They got the pony and the dwarf and the and the masks, the sorcerer and the laughing clown. Everything they got the whole whole, whole everybody here. Uh, Goro, that's not too dangerous. They got a police pre. I suppose that's spirit damage. They got a dancer and a bard. They got the dancer would be pretty sweet. Although, we only deal 3 damage. Oh, actually, it works with Bora Kang. Although, they're gonna act. All of them gonna act. 
Okay, let's let's do that. Bora King is gonna deal two damage to everybody. Avernus is a good stat because uh, it also affects the initiative. So I'm just gonna do a shout on these. It's a pretty good ability. Yes. Yeah, he's taking damage. So Bora is gonna come very soon. Uh, and if I deal free damage to this bard that I cannot do, <laughs> then it would die. But that cannot be done. Hitting Goral is just completely pointless. And hitting the police is not as good. This is tough. I'm not sure what to do. Maybe we get a crit. Come on, Bora. Time to do the big show. Okay, one death. Finishing shot. Three damage. That's all we got. The two and the four is gonna come. But we can't finish off the four. Or oh, actually, can we finish off the four? We can finish off the four. Okay, let's finish off the four. But probably I should be more concerned about health damage. That seems like more of an issue. Uh, we can just act with everybody. Although, we're just gonna hit Coral here. Anyone who deals a little bit less damage gonna hit uh, the police. I don't have a way to control fight with these characters. Could be a finishing blow. Die, horsey! Alright, just take it. This game seems to be a, a little bit less focused on the decisions in, in the fight and more uh, the story and the decisions uh, leading up to a fight and like after the fight somewhat. Alright, let's go. Hmm. They're making some good progress. The only question is like, how do we handle this? When we clear this sector, how do we handle... How do we go back to town? Uh, I just wanna... Beeline toward... Where I need to go. Yeah, this is good. Just storage room. <gasps> A mimic! Avoidance! That's very good. So we're just avoiding random damage with this guy who's good at traps. Uh, certainly adds up as well. Need a second. Okay, let's go that way. We just went down a little bit, but can we actually go go on? We can. So we went through that. But the, and we cannot, we can't go back. So that was the problem that I ran into last time. That I managed to clean out the first town. But I somehow needed to continue. And I'm not sure how we go back. It seems like there's no way to go back. We just need to keep going. Is a little odd. And this is not go back to town. This is quitting the game. Hmm. 
I'm just going to keep going. Crap. Incoming! But I'm not sure how we're going to handle it. Are we going to find some... Currently, it seems like we just go in. And after one point... I, either we, we have to go to a certain point. Right now. Uh, just to lock in our progress. Or I don't know how we're going to do it. Crap. I don't like that. Boost everybody. Not what I like to see. So one and four is going to act soon. We can just kill the mad survivor. Pretty handy. I suppose the 6 damage is gonna be a little bit less useful once we get a higher combat stat. Oh, what I like to see. At least we're gonna get to act. Necroslave. I can hit the Necromancer, but I'm not sure if it's the best idea. The Necroslave is kinda weak. This necro save is boosted. Do I want to use my my shout? It seems like a decent investment still. We deal free damage, and we're gonna take less damage. Although it kind of leads all of them to hit the same guy, which is a problem. I should be a little bit less eager to use it. We can finish off the Necro Slave. Alright. I'll just go for a regular shot. Nice! No, not nice. Not nice. I take it all back. Just kill this fool. As long as I figure out how do we return to town. Without losing progress, we're gonna be in the clear. Hmm. Wait. Is that some kind of secret? Herbal bomb? I'll just take it. Can't go there. We're just gonna keep going. But we need to find a campfire, and, and it would be ideal if we somehow distributed the damage more evenly. Uh oh. You're approached by a ghostly man with a friendly demeanor. He smiles and says, Hello, friend. Can I trouble you for a moment? And he says, No, thank you very much. Luther is gonna do it. And he's gonna say, Fuck off. He seems to be hiding something. This raid might be dangerous. You refuse his offer and pass. We don't need to chance it. So it seems like if we deny him the opportunity uh, to interact with us. Uh, we can just avoid the random element. And just get in. Do I want to go that way, though? Or am I not? So this is gonna be 5, and this is gonna be 4. Although I, maybe I shouldn't be a puss. But I have a feeling that maybe I should be a puss. I'll just go that way. I'm trying to play it smart now, and we just want to get to the next sector. My aim is true. Oh yeah, just a bunch of dudes showed up again. And they're gonna act pretty damn soon. The police deals free damage. And the nobles are not as important, apparently. And we're just gonna hit the police. Not great now, but... 
can have some follow up. Oh, that's not good. Ooh, that's really not what we need. So, uh, the noble is gonna come, and we're gonna go with a uh, Bora Kang special. The nobles are still yet to come. Three and four. So I'm gonna shout on them. Although this is again a questionable move, because although he's I'm not sure if I like this guy. Because it makes sense. We deal we take less damage. But uh one, one member of the party takes more damage. So this ultimately doesn't really work out because it doesn't work with the campfire. It doesn't work with how do we uh, replenish health. It would be a lot better if we somehow spread out the damage. Hmm. Can't kill this guy. I can kill the noble. I suppose I might as well. Yeah, I just finish up. Well, it doesn't matter. Let's hit this guy. Maybe we get a crit. Nope. Oh, that's a big hit. At least we're gonna ha have something to heal. Something to look forward to. Finishing blow. Yeah, just that should be good. Wow. There's no safe harbor in this game! <gasps> I just wanna go back to town! I changed my mind! That place is great! Okay, another fight. Um, maybe just go this way. Hmm. Oh, stuff! Yeah, just complete garbage. Good planks, junk, more junk. <gasps> Mimic, that's not what we want. Avoid it! Pretty handy though. So, having a guy who can avoid traps uh, definitely helps. Is this, is, is this really the best we got? Some wood? If you could find a campfire, maybe they should. I should treat it more like a. a <gasps> How could I forget about that game? No. God damn it! I mentioned it not not long ago. Oh, this is what I want: campfire. So we need to treat this uh, line. Like, we gotta stay until until we really get to the point where it's just too dangerous. And we can maybe find some uh, rooms that we can benefit from. But we definitely shouldn't stay after uh, it gets too high, because we just die. So Bora Kang is gonna do the thing. Yes, and we can do this, some singing, we can do some... Uh, oh, resting is the best. V. I can use Parable Balm, usable by camping, on Lionel. You can also use the Med Pouch on Lionel. So this is a this is really good. As long as you got these things to use on that person. Health minus and plus vigor. No, that's not what we want. So let's just do whatever we can to up the morale. And this causes us extra terror. Hmm. Despite the danger of the surrounding area, your party gains much needed comfort from the camp pirate's board. Okay, so the health goes up. And I suspect that, or at least that's what the game says, that uh, if we didn't have a character that had high overwatch, 
then not only we would gain less, but also we might even get attacked, which is terrible. Yeah, we're just gonna gain some uh, vigor. Seems like vigor is maybe not as as, as important. Or at least it's, it doesn't seem like it's very important, but as far as I know, if Vigor goes down to zero, you die. Or maybe something really bad happens. So in a way, it's like a second health bar. So I am maybe a little more, bit more concerned about health. But Vigor is basically just another health bar. So I just go. Yeah, I'll just head out. Where are we? Okay, not too bad. So our main guy, main, main tank guy, is not dead. He's half dead. Which is a lot better than being dead. Do we need to get to some certain space? Certain... Certain... Location? I don't know. This seems just crazy. The the adventure never stops. When do I save progress? Oh my. I just want to go back. I just want to save some progress. Yeah, let's go in here. Okay. This is pretty... Pretty straightforward. Uh, we don't have a lot of uh, room here. But actually we are making progress here because we started here. And now we are halfway in. So this... Um, I just have the wrong game. In mind for this, but it seems like we gotta reach the end. And when we do that, uh, the progress is gonna be safe. Else we just need to restart. Or maybe that's how it goes. Who knows. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. And uh, see you next time.